Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuvir. In this class, we will discuss about the combination examples on couples. In our last class, we clearly discussed multiple examples on combinations. This is a continuation class. This is a bit complex to understand. Please watch our previous classes and come back here. Our explanation is completely based on the assumption. You already have that basic knowledge. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Coming to today's class, it was given the total 10 couples available. 10 couples means 10 men and 10 women are available in our input. So from that we need to choose 4 of them. What is the condition? 2 men and 2 women should be there. You have to select a combination of 4 members. In that 4 members, 2 men and 2 women should be there. Total how many are there? 10 men and 10 women. 10 couples has been provided. So this is very simple. From simple to complex we move. The first one is very simple. Multiple examples we have done previously. So from 10 men you have to choose 2. How many ways you are going to choose? 10 C2 multiplied by. From 10 women you have to choose 2. 10 C2 ways. Why multiplication? We have done discussed previously. Again we are not uh, explaining this why multiplication here. So total you have to choose 4 members that should include 2 men and 2 women. So from 10 men, 2, two men has to be selected. In how many ways you can select? 10 C2 multiplied by 10 women, 2 women, 10 C2. So this is our output. Coming to the second one, second one is a bit complex to understand. You need to choose 4 members and it should include 2 men and 2 women. Up to here it's same, but there are there is one more condition here. But do not choose a couple. If you select four members, in that four members you should have two men and two women. But you should not have a couple. What's the meaning of that? You should not have a couple means you do not choose any couple means ten men, ten women. These are couples. Means M1, W1 is a couple. M2, W2 is a couple. M5, W5 is a couple. M10, W10 is a couple. In our chosen four members, you should not have couple. Means, you need to understand it. If you choose M1, you are not supposed to choose W1. If you choose M5, you are not supposed to choose W5. They are forming a couple. You are not allowed to take couples. So, in order to do that, so the first one is choosing two men. Yes, out of ten men, you can choose any two of them. So, 10 C2 ways. Once you choose W1, W5 in this choosing 10 men, if you, if you choose M1 and M5, means man 1 and man 5, M1 and M5, you are not allowed to choose W1 and W5. So, from 10 men, you can choose any two of them. You can choose them in 10 C2 ways multiplied by. Once you choose two men, those women should not be allowed. Means, Total how many women are allowed? 8 women possibility is there. Out of 8 you have to select 2. Because if you choose W1, W5 here, w, uh, so M1, M5 here in men, you are not allowed to choose W1 and double 5 That's why total how many women are there? Choose 2 women out of 8. You don't have 10 now. That is the point you need to understand. 8 C2 ways. Total how many ways? 10 C2 multiplied by 8 C2 ways. You are not supposed to include couple. The same with the next one. If you understand the second one, third one is very very easy. Choose four members. In that four you should have two men and two women. Exactly one couple should be included. So total you are having ten couples. From the ten couples you can choose exactly one couple. So first you have to choose one couple. Any one couple you can choose. How many ways you can include one couple? You can total how many couples are there? 10 couples are there. You can choose one couple. So 10 C1 ways you can include couples. So if you include one couple means one man, one woman has been obtained. Total how many remaining places? You have to fill one man and one woman. So once you choose couple 10 C1 multiplied by. Now you can include one man. So how many men remaining? 9 men remaining. 9 C1 ways you can choose man multiplied by. 
once you choose a man from out of nine here it should not include couple suppose in this nine men if you choose w m6 you are not supposed to include w6 here that's why reduce one woman from out of nine you are having option only eight options are there to choose women eight c one woman can be chosen because if you choose w6 you are forming a second couple this is one couple you are forming a second couple here you are not allowed to form second couple exactly one couple should be allowed so this is the total combinations 10 c1 multiplied by 9 c1 multiplied by 8 c1 so total these many combinations you are having to choose exactly one couple so now coming to the uh, next example that this is also a bit complex to understand if m1 is included then w6 should not be included then w6 should be selected if then this is the statement if this happens then this should be happen if m1 not included you may include you may not include w6 that is what the condition for if then in our discrete mathematics the first first uh, videos we discussed this mathematical logic if then if this happens then this should happen w6 w6 should be included if this not if this does not happen you may you may not include w6 it's up to you it is not a condition so this is what uh, you have to choose four members out of that four members uh, two men and two women should be there and one more condition if m1 is included then w6 should be included so now if you want to choose so how many different possibilities are there write that possibilities choose m1 and w6 this is one possibility means you selected m1 and if you selected m1 w6 should be included so m1 w6 included so one man position field one woman position field how many man positions remain one man position remain how many women positions remain one woman position remain so those places can be filled with uh, how many men are there nine men are there 9c1 ways you are going to select men multiplied by how many women are available 9 because we already included w6 9c1 women can be selected so 9c1 multiplied by 9c1 this is one possibility if you include m1 and w6 if you are not going to include m1 then you may include w6 or you may not include w6 it's, it's both the conditions you have to check so m1 not included so how many ways you can choose men two men out of nine you removed m1 9c2 ways multiplied by you may include w6 or you may not include so total how many options are there how many women are there 10 women are there 10c2 this is the second possibility 9c2 multiplied by 10c2 so total possibilities are this plus this either this happens or the second option happens that's why we are going with summation so total possibilities are 9c1 multiplied by 9c1 plus 9c2 multiplied by 10c2 these are the total possible combination selections we are going to do for this condition if m1 included then w6 should be selected hope you understand these examples if you have any questions regarding the concept please post two questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you